Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Cara Dancing, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I got this makeup look. This is like my go to makeup look and like everyday wear. Um, I don't wear makeup all the time, but when, but when I do wear makeup, it's either literally nothing or everything. So, this is the sort of look that I will go for. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and comment down below any videos you guys would like to see next. And if you do want to see how I achieve this look, then just please keep on watching. Oh my god, I'm dripping. Oh my god. That is a lot. Ooh. That is such a pretty colour. I just realised that I'm wearing white. Oh my god. Literally look, I like that. Okay. Okay, so I've already moisturised my skin and now I'm going to be going in and doing my eyebrows. I'm going to do my eyebrows off camera just to save a little bit of time. But for my eyebrows, I'm going to be using the NYX Tame and Frame Brow Pomade. This is such a good brow product. I've literally used this for ages now and highly recommend. See all my eyebrows, I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Flawless Concealer. I literally tried this out the other day and it's such a good concealer. Okay, so I'll be back after I've done my eyebrows. In a minute. Okay, so now I've got my eyebrows on and I'm going to get started with my foundation. Okay, and for foundation, I'm going to be using the YSL Touche Club foundation. I'm just going to get two to three. Oh, it's a bit splattery. Get. There's literally foundation in the ball, the pump's not working. Okay then, I'm just gonna be taking that on my Unicorn Cosmetics foundation brush. This is in the style UC001. Um, I'm just gonna get a bit of foundation and start buffing it on my face. I have already moisturised my skin. I don't really like to prime because I just don't. I just don't think it does anything. Really well, primer for me does nothing. So. I literally like to use moisturiser. The moisturiser I normally like to use is the Nivea Men's Moisturiser and it lasts for so long. Pop a bit on my forehead. I'm just going to be taking my sponge, it's literally so dirty, I need to wash it. And I'm just going to go over that with a beauty blender until it's all smoothed out. And then for concealer, I'm going to be going in with the e.l.f. Flawless Concealer, what I obviously use to do my eyebrows. I'm just going to do a few swipes of this. A few, I literally like putting the whole bottle on. By the way, I don't wear makeup all the time. Most of the time, I literally don't have it on. But if I'm going to go out or something, that's obviously when I will put it on most of the time i'm literally just like relaxing so i don't really wear it i only really wear makeup to go out or if i'm doing a makeup look for instagram i literally love this concealer so good and it's literally like five pounds i'm gonna be going in with the cyo powder it's so annoying because this is literally like one of my favorite powders and i think they're discontinuing it it does make your foundation go a little bit darker, but honestly, I don't mind that because I like my concealer and foundation to be all one colour. Put a little bit on the chin and on the forehead. So in the T-zone. The T-zone. I can't speak today in the T-zone. So I'm now going to be going in with my Coral Spectrum palette from Zoeva. I've literally had this for so long. It's such a good palette. I'm just going to be grabbing a mixture of this shade and this sparkly shade. This is a blush palette, but this shade down here, I like to use it sometimes as a bronzer, just because it is quite of a orange toned. I'm going to start off in the middle of my cheek and then blend it out towards the front. I don't really put this like actually in my cheekbones. And I do like to focus this more towards the front of my cheeks. And then for my bronzer, I am going to be going in with my Fenty Beauty bronzer. And this is in the shade Shady Biz. Just going to be grabbing a little bit of this and popping it straight into my cheekbones. 
just to give me a little bit of shape. This is such a pretty bronzer. Oh, can use a mirror for this because I can't really see otherwise. Let me pop in that to my cheekbones there. I'm going to be doing this all over my forehead. And I like to go in circular motions. I always thought that swirling the brush would make my foundation underneath move. But it honestly doesn't for anything. I feel like it just makes it a lot a lot smoother. And I don't know how. <laughs> I'm just going to pop a little bit on my chin and under the jawline. And then for highlight, I'm actually going to be going into my Hanging in Hawaii palette from... Where is it from actually? Oops, from BH Cosmetics, and I'm going to be using the shade Hula. I'm going to get a small brush for this. Literally, just going to pop this down my nose. Such a blinding shimmer shade. I'm going to pop it on my nose, on the top of my cupid's bow, on my chin. I'm going to grab this massive fluffy brush and I'm just going to tap it in there a little bit and pop it right on my cheekbones. Just for a little bit of a glow. I'm literally looking at nothing right now. I'm just randomly putting it on. It's literally so pretty. I'm also going to grab this and add a little bit to my forehead, but not too much because my forehead is huge. So we don't want to enhance it too much. Right, and for lashes, I'm going to be going in with the Prima Lash Basics. I got these off of Pretty Little Thing. They're literally so pretty. Um, I use these normally on clients or people's makeup that I have to do. There is a bit of a close-up on the eyelash. The lash glue is dry. I'm just going to be going in with my mascara. And I like to use the Maybelline Snap Mascara. When it comes to mascara, I don't really mind what I use because I do wear eyelashes all the time. Okay, so there are the eyelashes. I literally love them. Now I'm going to be going on to the lips. And for... The lip liner i'm gonna be using the cyo lip liner and this is in the shade line them up i think and then i'm going to be going to actually hold up i'm going to be going I want a matte lip today. I'm going to be going in with the Ultra Blotted Lip from Colourpop. And this is in the shade Soft Spot. I'm just going to go back in with my lip liner. Okay, so this is everything for today's video. And this is like my everyday go-to makeup look. Obviously, I said earlier in the video that I don't always wear makeup. But when I do wear makeup, this is the sort of look that I will go for. So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you liked the video. I'm trying to get more into the habit of posting videos for YouTube and for my Instagram. So there will be videos up very soon. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and comment down the videos you guys would like to see next. Um, I think that's everything. So I'll see you guys in the next video.